Assalamu alaikum students. Today we shall learn about the metals and matter. What are metals? Metals are materials got from the metal ores in nature. In nature. Metals are materials got from metal ores in nature. Examples of metal is gold, silver, aluminium, iron, copper. Okay. So what are metals? Metals are materials got from the metal ores. Example gold, silver, aluminium, iron, copper. This is copper. Now metals are strong. Metals are strong and hard. Okay, metals are strong and hard. Metals are shiny, shiny. When we heat the metal, we can form any shape. We can give different shapes to the metal. See the shape, it is a like a thin wire. The shape of this is round. Metal can make, may, can be heated and made into, make into a shape, round shape. It can also be made into a square shape. So when heated metals, they can be shaped into different things. Okay, now metal, matter. What is a matter? Matter is anything natural or man-made that occupies space. Now can you see anything this in this space? This is a space space available. Can you see any spare thing? If I keep a counter here, then this counter occupies the space or this space. This space is occupied by this counter. It is a matter. Counter is a matter. Now, if I, if I place a pen here, the pen is occupying this space. A space. Okay. It is occupying a space. Now, if I keep a coin, a coin is occupying this space. So, what is the matter? Matter is anything natural. Natural means human being is a matter. Water is a matter. Mountain is a matter. Sun is a matter. Star is a matter. Earth is a matter. C is a matter. Anything which is occupying naturally. Man-made. This counter is a man-made. Coin is a man-made. This is a bad. This medal is a man-made. So anything which occupies naturally or man-made thing that occupies space is matter. Matter occupies space. Matter is anything natural or man-made. Okay, next. Hmm. National days and national festivals. August 15th, Independence Day. January 26th, Republic Day. November 14th, Children's Day. October 22nd, Gandhi Jayanti. So, the national festivals are celebrated. Independence Day is celebrated on August 15th. Republic Day on January 26th, Children's Day on November 14th, Gandhi Jayanti on October 2nd. Now, who is the first president of India? Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. Who is the first president of, sorry, who is the first prime minister of India? Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. Who was the first president of India? Dr. Rajendra Prasad. Who is the father of our nation? Mahatma Gandhi. Tamil Nadu state animal is Nilgri Tahir. Tamil Nadu state fruit is jackfruit. Now, now let us learn about the three R's which three, the, there are three R's which help our environment which serve our environment 
they help to keep our environment help to keep clean okay what are the three r's the three r's they are the best friend of the environment best friend of the earth best friend of the nature what are they reduce one r is reduce one r is reuse one r is recycle what is reduce don't waste the materials don't waste materials make use of less materials if your parent buys you an eraser don't cut it into pieces within 2 or 3 days and make your parent to buy another eraser it is a, it is wasting the materials if your parent buy you a notebook don't tear the pages and then buy another notebook within a short time this is not correct don't waste materials make use of less materials now when you go out of your room don't forget to switch off the light and fans if you do so you save the electrical energy which is helpful to helpful for the for our environment next close the tap when you brush or when you take bath don't waste the water by just opening the tap and making the water to flow down this is wasting water so reduce the usage make use of less materials okay one r which is the best friend of our nature next is reuse now we can reuse some materials now if you have oh, torn clothes okay if your dress becomes short don't throw it away don't make it as a waste make use of the torn clothes or short clothes short dresses for kitchen work kitchen use and also to clean the vehicle okay clean the uh, things which you clean the dust dirts everything okay then paper which you don't use unused paper if you go in the from second standard to third standard your subject note will have some papers in which you you should have you would have not written anything now make take tear the papers and make it a make bind it bind it and make for, make a book for your rough use make it a rough note so this you are reusing the um, uh, things you are not wasting okay now next recycle some materials throw away materials can be used as a new product now all the papers which you books and notebooks all the records whichever you have used in one academic year can be recycled in into new products new paper old books old notebooks can be recycled to new papers for and you can use for the next academic year as an examination paper as a drawing paper etc now if a glass is broken you should not throw it away you can heat and make it into new glass items so if you if you you reduce make use of all these three r's reduce reuse and recycle then you can make your environment clean less polluted